Welcome to Surgery Squad's Virtual Abdominal Liposuction. I'm Dr. Susie, and I'll be assisting you with this surgery today. Liposuction is a minimally invasive surgical procedure that is used to remove fat deposits from various areas of the body. The areas that liposuction is generally performed are the abdomen, hips, inner and outer thighs, flanks or love handles, and inner arms. Today we'll be using the tumescent technique to remove fat deposits from our patient's abdomen. The word tumescent means swollen and firm, and with this technique we'll be injecting such a large volume of the fluid into the fat deposits that our patient's abdomen literally becomes tumescent. After injecting the fluid, we'll be using a hollow metal tube called a cannula to break up and essentially vacuum fat deposits out of the body. Before we begin, remember that liposuction is not an alternative to diet and exercise. And, unfortunately, not everyone is a good candidate for liposuction. To be a good candidate, one must usually be over 18 years old, in good general health, be within 30% of their ideal weight, and have made an honest attempt at losing weight through dieting and exercise with little success. Luckily, our patient is not only a great candidate for liposuction, but she doesn't smoke which will greatly speed up the recovery process. Now that we've covered the basics, let's scrub in. The first thing we need to do is mark the target area. This provides our patient and ourselves with a clear idea of where we'll be removing fat deposits. Why don't you give it a shot? That looks great! Now we need to take photos of our patient so she can see the before and after results. Go ahead and take one picture of the front of the patient's abdomen and one picture of the side. Next, we'll have our patient turn to the side so you can take the second picture. Nice composition! Our patient has been prepped and is now in the operating room. The next step is to numb the incision points that we're going to use to extract the fat deposits. Give it a try! With the incision points numbed, we're going to inject the tumescent fluid using an infiltration cannula to anesthetize the target areas and dislodge the fat deposits, making it easier to suck them out. Go ahead and take a stab at it. Excellent job! Now that we've injected the tumescent fluid, let's begin the liposuction. Use the suction cannula to remove the fat deposits from the patient. You're a natural. Have you ever considered a career in the medical field? Now that we've completed the liposuction on our patient, it's time for recovery. We're not going to suture the incisions. Since they were so small, they can heal without sutures. Our patient will need to wear a compression garment for two to six weeks. 
This garment holds the tissues together, controls swelling, and provides additional support as her body heals. She should be able to return to normal activity within a few weeks, and there will still be some bruising that should fade within a few days. Any swelling that our patient has may take a little while longer to subside. The final result of the liposuction will be evident in about one to three months after the surgery, although they will see a noticeable difference within days or weeks. Although the suctioned fat deposits are gone, if the patient does not maintain a proper diet and exercise regimen, the remaining fat deposits could enlarge, creating irregularities in the patient's abdomen. And that's abdominal liposuction. You've done a fantastic job. Why not try your surgical skills in another great surgery? Here at SurgerySquad.com. Check out our other videos on SurgerySquad.com.